Hey there, I'm Lucas Bond with the Missouri Department of Conservation and today we're going to be talking about strip disking here on Habitat Hints. Talk about why you should do it, why it's so important and so much more. We're going to be joined by MDC's Aaron Jeffries and he's going to tell us all we need to know about strip disking. Let's turn this around. All right, so we're talking strip disking. So Aaron, tell us, you know, why strip disc? What, what's, what's so important about that? Hey, Lucas, uh, good to see everybody. Uh, so what we have is a, a, a CRP planting. It's, a, it's probably 30 years old, so it is planted very heavily with grass, very few uh, native forbs, which, are, which is your broadleaf plants. Uh, so burning is, is good. We do do summer burning on this property. Uh, but we're really trying to set the, back, the grass back even more. And so what we're doing now is incorporating strip disking uh, as well as strip herbicide spraying, which uh, we've seen that, and there's a little bit of both here. Mm -hmm. But that strip disking uh, allows uh, for broad leaves and annual grasses to come up. It creates bare ground for, for quail and rabbits to move through. And so as you can see, we have quite a few annuals in here. There's, there's croton. There's Desmodium, which is a perennial. You, you have a, a wild bean here, which is, is great as well, uh, but also uh, partridge pea. So you're really creating quite a bit of diversity uh, to really create better habitat for, for quail. So this is just basically another opportunity, uh, another thing you can do to create better habitat on your land. Absolutely, yep. Awesome, yep. where can we learn more about that, Eric? Hey, best place to go to is mdc.mo.gov and just look at our habitat management page. Real quick, Aaron, tell us how you do strip disking. Uh, strip disking, uh, you know, just hook the disc up behind the tractor, uh, and generally I do about 20 to 30 foot wide strips, leave an undisturbed area of equal width, jump over the next spot, and then repeat that process uh, across the field. Awesome, awesome. Thank you very much, Aaron. And I'm going to echo what he said. If you want to learn more about strip disking, you can get on our website at mdc.mo.gov and search strip disking. Also, you can lurk, look in the contacts and you can search your private lands conservationists and chat with them and they will definitely be able to help you out. Thank you and have a great rest of the day.